Carl here. Let's talk about number slices and how do you add those in Power BI and what do they look like. Let's go ahead and start with the data table. So we're going to add a customer data table. We want to see customer names and we want to see customer sales. So let's come here. Customer, customer sales. I'm going to change this name and expand this out. So let's go ahead and add in a slicer. And our slicer, instead of a date this time, we're gonna add the quantity. So this is just gonna be a number. So now by adding the quantity to our slicer, we get to see the customers that bought between one and eight items. So if I wanted to say, well, show me some customers, show me all the customers that bought between five and eight items. By doing that, now I get to see all those customers that bought between five and eight items. Or I can even say, give me all the customers that bought either five or six items. Now I can see all of those customers as well. Another thing you can do here with this slicer is you can come here with the list. And when you do the list, I'll just expand this down. Now I can say, give me all the customers that bought eight items. So these are all the customers that bought eight items and so on and so forth so give me all the customers that bought two items or give me all the customers that just bought four items now now that I have those now that I have that option I can do that one more thing we can do here with the slicer and I'll just leave that one and add a new slicer here and I'll just bring this up right beside this one is we can also add sales so I'm going to add sales in for our number value. So these are all our sales between $7 and $28.99. And what I can do here is I can drag to see, give me everything, all the sales made between these numbers. Or I can just get rid of this all together and say, give me all the sales between $10 and $15. So now I'm seeing all the sales in between those numbers. Another thing I can do is I can clear this selection and I can say give me four and then with this four selected I can say give me all the sales in between 10 and give me all the sales in between 15 so now I see all the items sold that's in between all the items that sold four items that's in between 10 and 15 dollars now we know how to use number slicers in Power BI